Hey everyone, welcome back to the Movie Vault. My name is Rob. In today's discussion video, we're going to take another look at a movie from the Marlena Dietrich, Joseph von Sternberg box set that was released by uh, Indicator Pictures. Next movie up is Shanghai Express, which is fantastic artwork here. Interestingly enough, this is the only release in the box set that doesn't feature a cream or a white sort of... Um, uh, Digibook, I guess these are called, uh, the cardboard uh, cases. It's all in black here. It looks fantastic, as you can see there, even inside all the artwork in there as well. And on the back, uh, all the bonus features on there as well. Um, so this was originally released in 1932, 82 minutes long. This one's going to run 1.33 to 1 aspect ratio. So that old school 4 to 3 picture you're going to get on there. Mono soundtrack and black and white look stunning. Directed by Joseph von Sternberg, of course, and stars Marlena Dietrich, Clive Brook and Anna Mae Wong. Speaking of Anna Mae Wong, there is an interesting uh, bonus feature on this. It's 24 minutes long, Trouble in Hollywood. It's a uh, writer and filmmaker, Jasper Sharp uh, explores the life and career of Anna Mae Wong. Uh, quite interesting, 24 minutes in the bonus features. So uh, just a couple of kind of notes of interest or discussion here to have about this one. Uh, I made some notes as I was watching this. The kind of hustle and the bustle of the train station as Marlena Dietrich arrives once again, uh, striking look to that sort of scene. Um, interesting stuff there and um, the fashion once again all black outfits she's silent she doesn't say a thing really really interesting introduction to her character for the movie here and um, the train coming down the tracks the camera angle and um, is quite interesting uh, it's um really gives you the kind of claustrophobic feel in that one three three to one aspect ratio and um, the train coming down and then kind of going under i guess underneath the camera and the steam out of the steam engine kind of coming up into the camera and um, really interesting shot i thought there you really get the claustrophobic feel of the train station and um, fantastically done there and um, so basically marlena dietrich encounters an old lover on the train on the shanghai express is the train and then um, sort of interesting stuff happens uh, along the train journey and um, um, one kind of note of interest there's no subtitles there's people are speaking french and chinese and there's no subtitles at all um so you kind of have to try and figure out what they're saying to each other um which i thought was kind of interesting of course you can turn the subtitles on on this uh, blu-ray but then you get subtitles for everybody even english speaking actors um so i just thought that was of interest to note there um when the train is taken over, it's all kind of done in silhouette, um, which is really cool. I like that look, um, quite interesting. Um, more interrogations at a desk by like army officers. Um, if we go back to Dishonored, uh, another movie that we looked at out of this box set, same thing there again. Uh, I thought that was interesting. There is some rough camera cuts, rough edits in the movie. Um, I'm not too sure if that's just because of the restoration. They've done a 4K restoration on this. Um, looks fantastic but some of those you know 1932 uh, some of those cuts look quite rough to me uh, maybe that was uh, how it was intended originally um the um where she's begging for the captain to be released and attempts to shoot her captors um chang it's, it's really interesting uh, i thought that was a that was a standout scene here Another great line by Anna Mae Wong's character in this. Uh, she says to, I believe it's Clive Brooks character. Um, you better get her out here. I've just killed Chang. Uh, fantastic stuff. After she kind of assassinates Chang. And they kind of make their escape then. Uh, after the train's been taken over and stopped. They sort of get the train uh, rolling again as it were. It's kind of a very different character for Marlena Dietrich. From the previous two movies we've looked at here I felt. And uh, once again towards the end we get another iconic shot of marlena dietrich just smoking um fantastic stuff at the end um that's really all uh, i can i kind of have to say about this one in this quick discussion video here um once again if you're interested in picking this one up shanghai express it's uh, it's part of that marlena dietrich joseph von sternberg at paramount 1930 to 1935 box set by indicator pictures and it is a limited uh, numbered limited edition release so you may want to pick that one up but um yeah that's going to do it for this quick video on shanghai express next one up is going to be blonde venus so do stay tuned to the channel for that one let me know down in the comments if you have any if you would like to have a discussion about this movie if you've seen this any thoughts any standout scenes or anything like that to you guys and um, if you've watched this one just let me know in the comments as always thanks for watching if you like it please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and please consider hitting the bell to get notified every time i post a new video thanks for watching and i look forward to seeing you guys on the next video